This is the top 10 Doomsday Predictions Beyond 2012. Number 10. NASA predicts massive solar flares in 2013. Now obviously, by now, this date has passed. However, many people accepted this particular idea that there would be massive solar flares, which would include the accumulation of 11 years of sunspot activity. There would be a massive series of bursts which would bombard the Earth, getting through the electromagnetic defences of the Earth, knock out our satellites, our computers, power grids, and drag us back to a situation of civilization going back a thousand years. Obviously, many people took the ideas that were expressed by NASA and simply ran with it. 9. Biological weapons will destroy humanity, 2016. For this story, sources were few and far between. Nothing as reputable as NASA. The idea seems to have originated with the Weekly World News. That fun little publication which says news in the title, and yet we know is utter fabrication. One part of supposed evidence to support the claim was a time capsule as dug up by some students which had the claim in there that 2016 would be the time when humanity would be destroyed by a biological weapon. Before people knew it, before people realised it, they were supporting a completely factuous idea. 8. The Battle of Armageddon 2018. Hal Lindsey famously predicted that in 1988 humanity would see the final battle of Armageddon which would herald the second coming of Jesus Christ and the end of all life as we know it. The idea was that Jesus would return one generation after or the restoration of Israel. It was founded in 1948 and so as a result Hal Lindsey assumed 1988 would be the time. It came, it passed, and obviously nothing happened. So his argument is now, instead of it being 40 years as a generation, instead you have to say 70 years due to the life expectancy on average going up considerably over the last couple of centuries, which puts the second coming around 2018. 7. Armageddon 2020 there are few people more renowned in the world of psychics than Jean Dixon. Between the 50s and 70s, she predicted so many instances, such as the assassination of Dr. King, the assassination of JFK, Sputnik, and allegedly, President Richard Nixon consulted with her on numerous occasions. According to this Christian psychic, in 1973, she made the claim in her book entitled Call to Glory, she said that the time of Armageddon would be 2020. The false prophet, Satan, and the Antichrist, collectively known as the Unholy Trinity, would rise up, they would conquer the earth, and eventually would come to blows with Jesus Christ himself, who would return sometime before 2037. 6. The Sign of Two, 2029. The vast majority of predictions about the end time within the Western world have been focused around Christianity and the return of Jesus. A man named Mike Flip allegedly saw the signs leading up to 2005. He had the idea that the number two played a pivotal role. So two years before 2005, he thought that he knew that the time was coming. And supposedly by some kind of nonsensical process, he worked out by deciphering the various signs in the world around us that the time would come in 2029. 5. The Robot Takeover 2030 This prediction comes from a 2000 Wired article by Bill Joy, who co-founded Sun Microsystems. In his article, he describes the ways in which technology is evolving so fast that eventually it will overtake human evolution and bring about the extinction of our society. He believed that in 30 years, 
robotics would reach the intelligence level that would be sufficient to allow it to operate without us, rendering humans obsolete. 4. The year 6000, 2240. The Talmud is the second most important religious text in Judaism, second only to the Torah, and according to some experts, it places the date of the Apocalypse at 2240. The Hebrew calendar states that the universe was created 3,760 years before the birth of Christ, meaning that 2240 is actually 6,000 years on from the creation of the universe according to Judaism. Every thousand years equates to one age, in other words, one day of creation, and thus 6,000 years is equivalent to God's six days or six ages of creation. The idea is at the end of this 6,000 year period, there will be a time of incredible turmoil around the world leading towards the end and then those who have been chosen and those people who are considered to be good by God will be resurrected. 3. The Quran Code 2280 Numerology is one of the most commonly used techniques when it comes to predicting future events. It's the belief that numbers often correlate to specific divine events and the repetition and the realisation of these patterns can help you to understand what's going to occur in the future. One of the most popular examples is the Quran code, which is the idea that there's a hidden code in the Quran based on the number 19. And by realising this pattern relating to the Quran and the number 19, you can work out what's going to happen according to Holy Scripture. So the idea is by fitting everything around this numerological pattern of 19, they can work out what the predictions for the future will be. And one of the conclusions of this code is that the end of the world will occur in 2280. 2. The Earth is swallowed by the Sun 7.6 billion years. Things will not continue in a straight line forever. In 7.6 billion years, the Sun will get bigger as it starts burning heavier elements. It will expand into a red giant consuming the inner planets, including the Earth. 1. The heat death of the universe. Although we can dismiss the ridiculous claims of pseudo-religion, pseudo-science, when it comes down to the inevitability of our destruction, we have to pay attention to some degree. The heat death of the universe theory states that eventually the universe will reach a state of equilibrium, and this lack of thermodynamic free energy will put a stop to all processes in the universe. 